stereo. Oh yeah. One eight bit track that never fails to wake me up is this one. I might feel the view like a front. Alright. And yes, we're playing on difficult because that is the original intended difficulty. Silly Japanese people tried to make it easier for North Americans. And I guess with all the, uh, you know, easy mode is the best mode, and, you know, easy mode is a good choice and all that. I mean, sure, but, uh... Doing it on purpose and calling that normal mode? No, that ain't gonna fly. Alright. Pole one's coming up. Pull this go. And I will change up the bird gif. Wait, why is uh, Quickman not on there? Oopsie. I oh, know, Quick is on there. I forgot Crash Man. Okay, let's try this again. Voting nine. Also, how's it going, Josh? Eh, I'm all right. Hey, Shadow Danzog, welcome in. I'm just starting this buster only challenge, and I'm probably gonna fail. Or at least I'm not gonna be able to do this in one stream. We'll see. Okay, so we got one vote for Crash. I guess we're going Crash Man. All right. Respawn rate is really weird. Screw it, just damage boosting out of there. They only do one damage. A 
Although, since I've been playing Mega Man Legacy Collection on my own time on Switch, I'm... Might try to slide a few times, because I'm up to Mega Man 4 there. No charge, I have no slide. Worth waiting. That's a buster only challenge. Well, you see these lemons I'm shooting? That's all I can shoot. With exceptions for obvious bosses that are immune to the pea shooter, that's all I'm using. I hate these guys. Also good to grind for energy, though. Although I'm gonna end up losing more than I'm gaining. Jerk. I have no recourse for that <laughs> whatsoever. I was supposed to go to the right. Whoopsie. Imagine wasting that much time just to get a freaking E tank. supposed to be friends. Why are you attacking me? Why must you attack? Oh, as long as I get to the halfway point, then it's all good. I just... Oh. Okay, yeah. Uh, that's a mulligan. <laughs> I was trying to reach the other uh, ladder. Although it's an extra life over there, so... Eh, maybe I don't need it. Crashman isn't that hard. Bruh, I told you I just woke up. <laughs> See, I'm getting hit by Mets. Tank it. Then again, you just have to tank it anyway, because if this is your first boss, you don't have any other recourse for it anyway. So 
not like the other games where you get Rush Coil to start. Actually, Rush Coil wouldn't even help you here. That's what I wanted. Okay, never mind, Crash Man's a little harder than I I can predict this jump trajectory a little better than it would be, uh, wouldn't be as hard. Okay, I think I'm getting it. That was over my head. Yeah, there is a decent variety. The only problem is a lot of them just default to jumping on you. Like, you could seriously name most of them Mario Man and they'd fit right in. Let's see if I don't get hit by this guy this time. Nope. I'm lucky they're few and far between. that E-Tank? Nope. I should really get it, though. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. Chances are I'll have to use it, honestly. from that side. Thank you. Yeah, 
Stupid birds, give me health. And not the small pellet either. Okay, this isn't helping. Seems to come from when you're where you're facing. Yep. Oh, I am on the wrong trajectory. This one. There we go. Oi! It's supposed to come from the other way. Well. I got the E-tank though. three, I only fly Crash Man twice. Wait, so that would mean around three. Never mind. Not trying for the extra life. I learned my lesson. Shit. I did not want to go through. Even though that slide was kind of cool. Alright, I guess I'll do it next time. Bit better, you and me both. to save the E-Tank, but uh, I think I'm going to have to use it. Did you have a predictable jump trajectory already? Jesus. Like, I think he's gonna do a far jump and he doesn't. Because he's a butt.
I didn't want to use the E-Tank, but... Such is the way of things. And yes, I'm using the uh, Mega Man 8 roll uh, sprite hack instead of the original. I think she looks better. Eight more to go. You mean seven? So there's eight robot bosses? I mean, there's technically what? Thirteen? If you count all the Wily bosses? Alright. Crash Man is out. Pole is up. Yeah, but if Wily counts as a boss, then you gotta count the Mecha Dragon, the, uh... Room. I'm not sure what to call it other than the room, you know, the one where you have to only use crash bombs. And then whatever else there was. I don't remember. One vote for Bubble. Anybody else? Looks like we're going to Bubble Man. Oh well. Definitely a respite from the rest of it. <laughs> Bubble Man's a bitch. Oh god, my eyes. I forgot about his freaking level. At least the stage music kicks ass. Forgetting that even reflected pellets have to be off screen. Yeah, trying to keep the beat and uh, not die to spikes, not the easiest thing in the world. a little sliver. Then it just immediately died of spikes. Nice. Of 
crabs. Something I forgot. Hey, there we Bitch pan down. Honestly, I wish this stage had an E-Tank, because I'd just go through this one over and over. Oh well, I profited two lives off of that, so... All right, Bubble Man's butt has been whooped. The Bubble Butt. Metal, you're gonna save the hard ones for last, are you? Anyone else? This is a democracy, after all. The majority of vote rules. Except the tie goes to tie, and since I'm tie, you know, I get to decide. But if you just leave it to Josh, then this is basically Josh's show. <laughs> Alright, the Josh show continues. I forgot Metal Man has an E-Tank. So I might do multiple trips of this just to uh, stock up. Also, the music kicks ass, so that's a bonus. Oopsie. I forgot, if we had an absurdly long amount of time, I could just sit here and, yeah, do this. Get all the lives and HP that I want. There's a reason these things never made a reappearance. I found out pretty quick that you can just grind them.
honestly easier to just ignore those guys. <laughs> Sprite limit, slow down. Oh, I dodged it and then I just walked it. Those guys are the bane of my existence and I don't know why. Ooh, another attack. That I can't possibly get without killing myself. Because I don't have I don't have uh, item three. I was about to call it rush jet, but yeah, it wouldn't even be rush jet with roll chan. It would be uh, tango jet. It's hilarious in Mega Man 2 how much stuff is weak to Metal Blades. Except for you. Because they only do two damage to you. On normal, they do one. You like Airman? Well, apparently Capcom likes Airman too because uh, all of... Like, every other game has an Airman-esque guy. Like, you know, just someone with a fan in their stomach. Real blowhards, you know? Would you rather I go back to Laughing Duck, Josh? Because I can go back to Laughing Duck. One vote for Woodman. Rusty all lurking. All right. Woodman it is. tanky those rabbits are. Both in this and in Mega Man Maker, it's just why do they have, like, was it 6 HP? Alright, time to do some zips. Alright, I don't know how to do zips. Oops.
easy grind spot for energy. If they drop some. Alright, screw it. As much as I want energy, I still have a stream to run here. Huzzah! Jazz hands. Dang burbs. Dang monkey. some drop energy now. Yep. <laughs> Whoever says that RNG isn't a sentient troll is very objectively wrong. Oh, made it up to me. All right. Thank you, Jazz Hands Monkey. I guess it's more Jazz Hands Gorilla. I'm actually not a fan of it. Like, it's good, but it's far too repetitive. Stupid derpy ass rabbits. like 8 HP. I have to count that shit out. Ah, Chocobos. Incredibly high HP Chocobos. Well now. So we can see me suffer against Woodman because Woodman's one of those guys that, like... I just have a terrible time against. Like, I don't know how to dodge those leaves. At all. That shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, not too bad. Wow, that maxed out for some reason. Thanks, RTX voice. Sometimes it just fucks up. is down.
Ball is up. Select butt to whoop. Which robot ass am I kicking now? Actually, while y'all vote, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. Be right back. All right, I return. And we have one vote for Heatman. And looks like it'll just be the one vote for Heat Man. All right. The heat is on. Man's literally just a zippo. of these and I always item three over it. Shit. This one's gonna be a suffer game. Especially when I do that. Eatman himself, not bad. The stage Oh, this stage. wait for that other one. Oh, nice. the stupid thing starts. Time for a guy with ADHD to memorize stuff. Yup. Hello, 
block timing. I know it pulls that instant jump at some point. I'm just not sure where. Shit. Changed the verb gif. All right. Let's go with the classic. Uh, no, because that clips on the controller. That's pretty much the same thing. There we go. grind these things when it's all instant death hits from here, but yeah, there we go. Troll ass disappearing blocks. That's why whenever I play a Mega Maker level, if I see them with that, I just instantly skip it. Yep, that just happened. There it is. Like, it just... You're fucked. If you... If you don't just blindly jump there, you're fucked. So one thing I wrestle with the uh, with the uh, Mega Man games about is, uh, you know, dying because of challenge, fine. Dying because of you don't know, dick move. And that's dying because you don't know. And yes, despite the amount of times I've played this game, I still, like, I remember that was there. I just don't remember specifically where it is. Even now, I don't remember where it was. I think it was the second one after the uh, low part here. I think it's this one. No, it's this one. 
Okay, got it. Another I'm just gonna jump on your head guy. to heat, man. Got a life left. Should be good enough. He's predictable as hell, though. <laughs> Except for when he does that. That was weird. And of course, he's one of those bosses that does an absurd amount of damage when he touches you. saying, but Ty, his body's hot. He's literally Heat Man. Yeah, but then why does the fire he's throwing do fuck all? I missed that jump. What? That almost screwed up my jump. Funnier is that extra life isn't an extra life, it's a met. So they really want to troll you in this. Later, man. Yeah, that's the troll block. That's why I hate those things.
I love like, I love the little icons. And the fact that they're named. Alright, you also like the butt to whoop? I'm gonna have a smoke. Alright, I return. And we're going to Flashman. Best music in Mega Man 2? Best music in Mega Man 2. I got a buddy who uh, had a band uh, back in the day, and uh, he did a bunch of uh, Mega Man covers as a medley. And this was one that he covered, and he, they did a really good job. I'm just gonna drift right through your ass. Works for me. Ah, noodles. That wasn't gonna hit. Ah, shit. Can't go that way. So with Flashman, I just have to get lucky that he doesn't uh, freeze anything. We've got New York Knicks Flashman, apparently. Some of the sprite palettes had to be edited for a uh, roll. I forgot, he's basically just a leg humper. I'm gonna hump that leg! No, Flashman, that is harassment. Item cat paw? That icon is not very clear. <laughs> oh, 
its tango lift. That's why, it is a cat paw. I didn't think Zinc had incorporated Tango into uh, Mega Man 2. Alright. So we go in air? Or, could be, or are we going quick? We going quick. Unless anybody else feels like voting. Hold out until the poll's a minute old. And that's a big fat no. Rest of you don't mind either way. Gotcha. This guy, I might have to go back and grind D-Tanks. Oh, I get it. Yeah, Tango's item three. That's cool. I remember this one very well. Oh, but there was an E-Tank there, son of a bitch. Also, question, why isn't that a Heat Man enemy? Also, I hate that guy. That's not good. I'm just gonna skip through that. So I have an E-Tank. It might be good enough. I forget how much damage Quick Man does. All I know is he's a jumpy bastard. Trying to kill him with crash bombs is a pain in the ass. <coughs> well, I got him halfway with half health, so... Maybe I can do it? I won't resort to the E-Tank until my uh, last life, though. What the hell kind of jump was that? Jesus. Now, 
Now, see, speedrunners would stand on the edge of these things because you, their hitbox, the horn thing's hitbox doesn't go all the way out. I am not so daring. How did I make that jump? <laughs> I'm too used to Mega Man 1 where you have to like precisely land on platforms. They have platform forgiveness from this game on. noodles for dinner. I don't need any more. See, they have airmen and airman stage. Okay, that guy just despawned. And I just died. I can do it with Mega Man, but with Roll? Oh, okay, yeah, there we go. I just say that like, I don't know if I can do it with Roll, and then I do it first try. <laughs> the roll sprite is she's not as wide as Mega Man. Yeah. So, like, it looks like I'd be falling off here, but I actually have a bit of a sprite to the side. As you can see when my foot moves out. Because that's where Mega Man's foot would normally be. Therefore, make the precision even worse. Oh well. I'm not gonna start on zero lives.
You know what I want to do, though? I want to do the uh, item one glitch. Because it's just so fun to do. Assuming I make it to Airman this time. Helpful burbs. Alright, I'm gonna rewind it, but uh, this is just awesome. Got it. I'm also stuck in uh, recovery mode. Yep. If you touch the door and get hit, you go right through the... Uh, touch the door with item one and get hit, you go right through it. That is a vanilla glitch, and the layout is Dr. Wily Stage 1. So if I actually spawned on top of everything instead of being stuck in the wall, then, uh... Yeah. Let's do this fight for real now. Item broom. Wait, did, they, did Sink make item three a flying broom? That's hilarious. Yep, it's a broom jet. That's just funny. Yep. It'll be a real witch, and I'll be fighting Wily in a UFO, and wait, this is sounding like Toho 12. I mean, roll shoots lasers. This tea is going right through me, so I gotta run back to the bathroom, so I'll leave you with probably the most iconic Mega Man track ever. Back in a sec. Alright, let's do this. Ability, but it works. Oh, 
it. Those things can't move, can they? Aha! More stuff to grind. I got through them eventually. <laughs> Sniper Joe, who couldn't snipe anything to save his life, shooting that frickin' slow. I don't know why, but everybody I see play this tries to spawn the uh, platforms starting at the top of the ladder. And you can just do this instead. It's a lot easier. Or, you know, use item three, but... Meh. Dragon time. just like doing the rewind. <laughs> well, that's the only reason that dragon is hard is because of the platforms you have to fight it on. Like, imagine fighting that thing, but you're on flat ground. It'd be an absolute joke. That would be a mini boss. Another thing I greatly dislike about uh, the Wily Castles is that they never refill your uh, energy between uh, levels. Actually, I think they do in two, but after that they don't. mini boss here because he's that weak. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
what I should have done, though, is uh, grind it for E-Tanks. Flying broom, go! It really is just a flying broom. Although that looks more like a bean. Shit. There's an E-Tank up there and I want it. all gone so wrong. They made that change from Mega Man 2 onwards. Oh my god, drop the large energy already. Yeah, there it is. And I picked it up by accident. Son of a bitch. Eventually we'll get out of here. And there we go. Actually, I should make sure the crash bombs are full. I'm not sure if this is the room boss, but, uh, you know, I can never be too careful. Thank you. 
Because unfortunately, when it comes to the uh, room, you have to have full uh, crash bombs or else you just can't beat it. Okay, I'm legit doing turbo here just so I can save my thumb. Y'all seen me mash this out. It's not like I'm doing this to beat a challenge or anything. Well, I am doing this to beat a challenge, but, you know, an actual, like, boss. Funny enough, Mega Man 1 has, like, mash protection in it. Like, you can't turbo, uh, you can't turbo down enemies. I guess I'll have to ref refill this because you. Once you use that, you just have to wait until it's done. Which is really stupid. The grind resumes. who don't know why I'm doing turbo. I got some really bad either arthritis or carpal tunnel or probably both. And if I mash too much, it hurts like hell. So I'd rather save the mashing for when it counts. Watch my cave story speedruns. No, I can freaking mash. So I don't feel too bad. Okay, so it is the room boss, but it's not the crash bomb room boss. I forgot there's multiples. Is this a boss again? Like, the only reason it's slightly hard is because it does so much freaking damage when it hits you. That's not the bitch. The next one is the bitch. <laughs> now, 
Now I got two E-Tanks. I need my crash bombs here, so I'm not wasting any more. I guess I could've gotten them back. No. Too late now. Hello, fish. Large fish. Super funny when later on I was playing Happy Wheels and there were spike falls. I was like, well shit, I did that in Mega Man all the time. Guts Dozer. Don't doze me. Don't doze me, bro. I don't know. <laughs> ah, I got dozed. GG. Yeah, guts man the vehicle. Once he got busted to shit in Mega Man 1, they're like, we can rebuild him even better. I didn't put like a steamroller attachment to the front of him or something. He could be a JoJo reference before JoJo. Rodurunada. Dang it, Matt. So the gap's this block. And that block, apparently. Cool. I never go over there, because I never have a reason to. And I also rarely fall. Apparently today's going to be the exception. ever. No, that's time stop. That's what I want. certain doom. And not certain doom like a certain guy would enjoy. Did it again. It's like a force of habit to fall through those. <laughs> I 
Sometimes I'll just iframe through this. Today I'm apparently deciding not to. See if I can make this jump the first try. <laughs> Got it. against that either. Thank you. Alright, here we go. So. The annoying part about this is that if I die, this doesn't get refilled, so I'm just screwed and I have to game over. So, I'm actually going to put it to a chat vote. Can I make a save state for this? This is in the essence, this is in the essence, this is in the, uh... I can't think of the word, but this is to save time. Because all that would happen is that I'd end up... You know, if I die here, then I just have to kill myself four more times, and then try all again. So, y'all can vote. I'll do it either way, but one's going to take a lot longer if I screw up. Alright, that's two for yes. No dissenting votes. Dissenting votes? Yes, it is. Did I not say two is going to take longer? Because that's exactly what I meant. Or are you making a poop joke? Oh. You know, what ain't going to take longer? Yeah, because this is what happens. You start back here. You have to go through all of this, and you have to refill your crash bombs. So I don't remember what the, like, ultimate strategy is here. Fuck, that hurts. Um... Before I get hit. Alright, 
It's really a pain in the ass that you can't bring up the pause menu until you're, uh... Oh, good, I got it. There we go. So it didn't save much time, maybe like two, three minutes, but... If I missed that, uh, shot right there, I wouldn't have enough. Worst boss in Mega Man. Alright, time for the refights. Which could be even worse, because I'm doing Buster only, so... Let's see. Not a good start. Definitely not a good start. Heat man, please. Do your slow charge up. Now, that was the only state save, uh, state load I'm gonna do. Because I remember doing this before, like, a few years back, and that room took me about two and a half hours by itself. Hey Josh, remember Mega Man 1 where they didn't refill your health? Yeah, you're fucking me over, but you're fucking the stream over, too, so. Like, I'll do it. I have literally nothing else to do, so. since it was new. Jesus. That's a long-ass time. My first one was Mega Man 3. Get off my leg, Flash Man. That is harassment. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm still saving my E-Tanks for Wily, because, uh... Yeah, I'll probably need both. Although I don't think Alien Wily can be hurt by anything but Bubble Lead, so... I'll need to use that. Fucking Crash Man's gonna make me use an E-Tank, though, isn't he? Yep. Well, if I have to redo this level, then I'm uh, doing Crash Man first. with your jump AI. I don't get it. I think Crashman is the reason that they invented the slide in Mega Man 3. Honestly. I take on the others, but that's just going to leave me weaker. tank or do I not? Nah, fuck that. I'll just fight him first this time. Because he's the one I have the most trouble with. But I'm gonna have a smoke. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. More Crash Man. You're jumping AI, dude. I still haven't figured it out. I don't get it. Yet. I almost had him. Two wasn't new. Probably around the time three came out. Yeah, that's... That's about when I played them. Unfortunately, I only ever got three and six. 
because my parents were tech illiterate, so um, getting new games out of them was uh, kind of a hassle. when I start to understand his path, then he does that, like, super crazy jump, and... Yeah. Yep, play at friends' houses. A lot of rentals. Same here. I lucked out, though, because I was a Nintendo kid, and my neighbor was a Sega kid. So, between each other, we had all the consoles. Which is awesome. Even better, his dad got into PCs later. So there's me, age 7, playing Duke Nukem 3D, and I'm like, fuck yeah, this is awesome. <laughs> he didn't have Doom, though. Which, disappointing. Oh my god, I finally beat him. You still have a 2600? Damn. Do you start a Mario on three, huh? And Kingdom Hearts, I'm sure you can play them in whatever order and you still won't understand what the fuck's going on, so, uh... cool. I wish I had any of my old consoles, but they all got lost to a flood. So yeah, I lost my NES, my SNES, my N64. My Atari 5800 with a working controller. Yes, I had a 5800 with a controller that actually fucking worked. And it got lost to a goddamn flood. Eh, shit happens. Okay, so I need some health back, still. Okay, I know that was Woodman, this was Heatman. Down here was... I don't remember, so one of these has got to be Bubble. There's Bubble. And the other one's Quick. Bubbles kicking my ass. Ooh. Now I got my health back. That's all I really wanted. Yeah, I didn't skip a Nintendo console until the Wii U. Technically, I skipped the GameCube because I didn't get it until much later. Had a PlayStation, then a PS2, and then I uh, got the GameCube. And then, like, a year later, I got the Wii on launch. What a mistake that was.
Super, yeah, I got the Super Nintendo really late, too. Oh, it was Air Man. Right, right, right. I have some health, I'm gonna fight quick, man. Alright, now hopefully Bubble doesn't kick my ass. Yeah, that's the difference, is as a uh, normal boss, he takes two damage on the buster. Here, he only takes one. This will be good enough for Ward Man, but we'll see. It is and it isn't because, like, when he has those, uh, when he has the obstacles to get over, he'll get stuck running in place. Because with the uh, normal one, he'll just move left and right or whatever, but then, you know, he'll only be able to move when he jumps, and then most of the time he's stuck doing this. So I actually prefer the uh, undulated arena instead of the flat one. Whoops. Please let that I'm gonna be God damn it. Back to Crash Man. <laughs> Back to getting my ass kicked, apparently. You know, it's funny, I never had trouble with the speeder level. I don't know why. There's a convention pretty close by, and they had uh, some old school setups. And I'm just like, "Hey, cool! There's a NES." I loaded up Battletoads, and I just did a full playthrough in one sitting. And I got people like, "Oh my god, that's crazy!" I'm just like, "What?" Because honestly, once you get past the speeder level, the rest of the game is kind of easy. <laughs> Pain in the dick to speed run, so. Then again, I also played it on arcades, which is a lot harder. With the sprite slowdown, at least on the NES, you can uh, kind of navigate what you're doing. Crystallis is one of those ones I like I heard of but never really played.
Okay, got him. I got two lives. Should be able to do this. I should have saved Metal Man, actually. I think I'm added to the list, though. Once Google decides to respond, because it's incredibly slow to Firefox for some reason. All right. Um... Yeah, I got full health so quick, man. Dude just glitched through the ground. Oh, quick, man. Finally loaded. All right, added to the list. I do a Jericho pen click there, but. Yeah, I don't have the charisma that guy does. Shit. Okay, heat man. Die, juke me. Well played, well played. Heat man, please. I don't have to do this again. Ugh. So this is where playing Buster only is a pain in the ass. Not so bad in 4, 5, and 6 because you have the charge shot, though. And arguably in 9, but then again, I uh, used to speedrun 9, so uh, that probably helps. Yeah, I got no lives left. Shit. Um, Windy Boy. some shit that I can actually dodge, please? Nope. Just gonna keep RNG fucking me. God. Man. Alright. Bubble, and I guess we gotta do Woodman last. Thank you. 
need to. Ah. All right, I'm just gonna use the damn E tank. I'm done with this. Never mind. As much as I want to rewind, nope. I think that's exactly how I died the last time, too. that in my first shot. Yeah, I think I'll do metal now. Yes, hold jump to jump higher, doofus. Welcome to Mega Man. Uh, bosses are obnoxious as shit. Yeah, at least I didn't die to Metal Man. But I guess that means I gotta kill Flash Man too. I'll have to save Flash Man. Shield. There you go. I said over the leaf shield, damn it. Just can't. Why? I had to get hit by that leaf even though I didn't need to. Ugh. That's just me being down on myself, though. Yeah. 
hit. Got him. Okay, so... I guess I'm gonna have to kill Bubble and hope that I don't get hit too much. I think this time, since I didn't die to Crash Man, I actually have an extra life. Just in case I need it. Okay. Quickest man ever be a quick man. I don't know. I have an extra life, so I'm not going to waste it. And by it, I mean the E-Tank. This, this is why. Son of a bitch. I didn't think it did that much damage. <laughs> okay. Flash man, you're not supposed to hurt me. Flash man, don't hurt me. No mo. That's how you beat Bubble Man. All right, Prancy boy, let's do this. Got it that time. Good. All right, I should have enough to take on Heat Man. Although Heat Man's kind of a wild card. There's no way to avoid that part. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, I was screwed there. Shit. And then I'll take on old windbag later. cleaner. This one's looking good. I don't know why they made the guy that throws literal saw blades the joke character. Like, he does such pathetic damage for throwing frickin' saw blades, and then you can two-shot him with his own weapon. Like, what? Alright, Wawi, let's go. Wait, where do my E-takes go? What? Uh, Kesko with luck? Okay, I have no more E-tanks. Apparently they're just gone. Bonesaw is ready. The cream. Yeah, I... It would be nice if I had my freaking E-Tanks. Hold up. I'm gonna do something here, because I don't remember if you can uh, go back. Do you have to start this all over again? Yeah, you do. Okay, so, uh... Yep, we just gotta do it.
At least I'm killing Crash Man now. Fancy pants, let's go. I guess I just had to mash them down. It's not the best way to be Woodman, but I can't dodge the leaves, so... Should be enough for bubble. Bouncing projectiles are just really hard to deal with. Like this, 
Easy. I say as I get hit. Twice. Three times. It's easy some of the time. That, I don't know. I guess I just have to strategically jump them, which is weird because they'll come in pairs, so I'm not sure how you're supposed to jump them? Question mark? I'm changing up the, uh... I change up the bird gift. Um, let's see. also seems to be eating my inputs. I hit jump a couple times there, and my inputs are on screen. They seem to have gotten eaten. Alright. Gonna have a smoke and then we'll try again. That's the thing, is I thought you could go under, but if you look at their arc, they're way too short of a hop distance to actually go underneath. Like, this is a Mega Man 3 Plus where you can just slide under where it'd be easy. And I have returned. Yeah, it's definitely a side effect of expecting me to use other powers. That's the entire point of Wily, is you use all the powers that you've gained to, uh, you know, win. Because when you have the other powers, it's an absolute joke. And just before I continue, I'd like to remind everybody of my schedule. And by doing so, I just minimize the damn screen. Stupid emulator. I wish I could change that uh, shortcut. So, yes, I will be uh, doing, hopefully, Mega Man 3 on uh, next Thursday night. That is my schedule for this week. If y'all are wondering about the question mark, that is a rando day. That is just whatever the hell I feel like. So yes, if you want more Mega Man action, it will be next Thursday. Well, this Thursday coming up at uh, 8 to 10 p.m. I don't have concrete start times because I'd never make it. Believe me, I used to I used to stream on a schedule, but it was a like. Okay, I'm turning this down because I keep redlining. Actually, I'm going to restart RTX voice because usually that's the problem. Hang on. Should be back. Hello, hello. Testies, testies. One, two, three. Yeah, looks like we're good. So yeah, what I used to do is I'd have a... Uh, my old schedule was just like a solid block of like eight to ten hours of one game and I just cannot do that. 
Rocky Mountain Oysters. Hell yeah. Sibilance. I remember in high school somebody did a prank over the PA where they did that uh, they did that mic check but instead of saying sibilance they said syphilis high school right they think that's funny it was just funny that it went on for like probably five minutes before it got shut off So he seems to jump in proximity to you. Oops. That's when I don't jump into him. Shit. Yeah, that's that's one of the things you can only appreciate as you get older. It's just knowing that, like, some of the stupid shit you did as a kid, you know your parents are like, that's pretty funny, but we gotta say it's bad. Actually, I'm just gonna game over on purpose here. Just noticed, thanks for the follow. Maybe this time when I break 200, I'll actually keep it. So you mean my bot promo actually worked? <laughs> so many people actively ignore it that I think Josh only really noticed it after being like a regular here for over a month. It's kind of funny. gonna game over on purpose because come on prancy pants it's probably easily doable on normal Of course it is, you take half damage. Thank you. 
Cleaner Flashmans too. Flashman, Crashman, Trash Can. No, Heat Man is a trash can. He's he's basically a bin. I know he's supposed to be like Ascension Zippo, but uh, yeah, he looks more like Trash Can. Trash incinerator. <laughs> now there's the original Rick and Morty moment. <laughs> Dr. Light assembles them. What is my purpose? You put trash inside you and you burn it. Oh god. to anyone out there. I do have a bunch of full stream VODs saved if you want to see me beating uh, Darkwing Duck or Little Nemo Dream Master or Mega Man 1 because I've already done that. I do have a uh, full streams collection on my uh, VODs page. I'm also slowly uploading all that shit to Odyssey too. If you don't know what Odyssey is, it's a YouTube alternative that supports its creators rather than its investors. Which you can get a link from Nightbot or through exclamation mark O D Y S E E. that it's just easier to tank and spank with airman. Oh well. Flashman, no, bad touch. about the Little Nemo movie. And yeah, every entire movie's on YouTube. Somebody's uploaded it. Two has been so long. It's like 29 years ago. Jeez. 
Crazy how time works in that linear fashion. Though none of us really wanted to. There's a lot of hits done on that. Got two tries, though. Ah, shit. that one. What? Okay, that froze me in place. That's some BS. It's really hard to dodge those. getting on this one. Eh, hey, Heatman will probably kill me the fastest.
I forgot that you can time it so that he shoots the wall instead. exactly benefiting me though, so I'm not going to do it. Alright, Heat Man, game over me. Yeah, it probably just doesn't let you keep your E-Tanks once you game over, and that's why I don't have them anymore. Ego boost. <laughs> You're not wrong. I think we've gotten to the regression part of this. You know, you're doing something for so long that you actually start getting worse at it. Flashman and Crashman on a list. The amount of uncomfortable closeness is not cool. Then again, you can say that about most of the uh, Mega Man bosses. Seriously, if I ever make a 2D platformer shooter, I'm going to have enemies that literally hump your leg. Like, that's all they do. They match your speed perfectly and your movements perfectly. They read your inputs so they can constantly hump your leg. Thank <laughs> you. 
This guy. This guy. Yep, we've definitely hit the regression stage. <laughs> It does look like he's throwing Pokeballs. Except Roll only knows one move and it's Sweep. Though I guess technically she'd also know Roll Out. Now we can continue with the rest of it. Finally. It actually messes me up when he goes slow. one of those guys you want to have a little bit of health for, but if you do it right, then you only take that initial take of damage, because I'm pretty sure it's impossible to dodge that fire. Alright, Dancy Boy, let's go.
I guess I'm doing metal, man. Wait, there's a Wolverine that has an Aussie voice? The only Wolverine I heard talks like this, bub. You see, you say brownish yellow costume, and I know you're talking about like the old school X Men outfits, but it just makes me think of Sabretooth <laughs> or Craven. See, I don't think I ever watched that cartoon. Or maybe we just didn't get it in Canada. I don't know. I know what crappy Marvel cartoon we did get, that 1960s Hulk, where they basically just, like, barely animated some uh, frames from the comic book. <laughs> God, anybody who says anime is lazy animation needs to watch that. Alright, here we go. looking at them, they all seem to follow the exact same arc. So I might be able to use that to my advantage. If I can find the spot to jump at them. Yeah, 
Yeah, it seems to be somewhere on the like middle of the screen, kind of like in this area. The only problem is Wily goes all the way over to here, so... I don't know, that's a toughie. Okay, never mind, they don't follow a pattern. My theory is... busted. I know you can't get behind them. There's an invisible wall. Got it. He's not throwing Pokeballs, he's throwing Voltorbs. That's what it is. My mic's actually picking up the uh, game audio. Sometimes when I take damage. You know, it's funny you say jumping around like Vega. Because Vega's actually Bison, and Bison jumps around more than Claw does. <laughs> Sorry, when you play competitive Street Fighter, they're just named uh, Claw Boxer and Dictator. Because all their names got changed around, because Capcom didn't want to get sued by Mike Tyson. So I always get confused when people say Vega because I'm like, do you mean Dictator or Claw? I guess the proper response to anybody saying that now is, haha, you play Street Fighter V. <laughs> what a dog shit game. Actually, at the most recent event, uh, the winner, Punk, had the best interview. Like, the announcers, uh, the interviewers ask him, like, okay, so what are you going to do in the meantime for the, until the next uh, Capcom Port Tour? He's like, I'm probably just going to play Guilty Gear. Honestly, the netcode sucks. So I'm going to save my mental health and, uh, you know, play something I enjoy. Like, oh shit. Like, official Capcom sponsored event, and this guy's just saying, yeah, I'm just gonna play Guilty Gear instead. This drive isn't that good either, but it's miles out of Street Fighter V. I say like I play fighting games anymore.
I accidentally fast forwarded there. Thanks to severe learning disabilities and uh, now that my hands are ridden full of arthritis and carpal tunnel. Um, yeah. Fighting games are not a worthy time investment. <laughs> I'm one of those weird people that likes Smash Bros. Brawl. That's like the only one I'll actually play. Mostly because when you're in the FGC, basically everybody just wants to play Melee. And they're of a certain socially inept persuasion that you don't want to associate yourself with. But then again, look at their top players. Got them. I'll still never forget the roast rage he gave somebody. Uh, they had one of the Smash Pros. Uh, this was when Ultimate was coming out. I had one of the Smash Pros uh, play against Reggie in Ultimate, and obviously Reggie got his ass kicked. But then the uh, Smash Bros player tried to be like, you know, wow, you suck at this game, blah, 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 and started talking mad shit to Reggie, so Reggie just went, I run a multi-billion co dollar company full-time. You play a video game full-time? It's like, oh shit. And smashers get a certain disdain amongst the uh, fighting game community. So, as much as I like the game, I do not like the community. <laughs> Crashman, Crashman, Crashman. You know, next time I game over, I'm gonna look up Buster Cheese strats. Because I'm kind of getting sick of this. He's literally my only hurdle. Well, if button mashing works, then it works. It's up to the other person to uh, figure a way around it. This is like people in like 2D fighting games going, oh, you spam fireballs. It's like, yeah, because you're not doing anything about it. Justin Wong had a good one where some kid was crying because he was playing against him in Mortal Kombat online. He's like, you keep spamming. You suck at this game. He's like, oh, you're going to learn today. 
You gotta learn. Yeah, pretty much. It's up to your opponent to adapt. Alright, let's see some of these uh, Buster only no miss, no damage. I get it. Let's see if I can put it into practice then. Back. I found the strat. Crash Man is a joke now. I mean, I did this with a Lack Man in Mega Man 1. Slower, yes, but look at me not take damage. The little damage I took is because I was an idiot and walked into him. Got him. Indeed. Yeah, let's do here, man. See. All right, my bad. Yes, don't run directly into Heat Man. It's usually a bad idea. Fire hot. Ow. Ow, fire indeed hot. 
Oh, Futurama. You were so good. I wouldn't trust Matt Green to make it now, though. So I'm kind of glad it's over. Yep. See, the slow one messes me up. Fry's dog. Like, that's both the best and worst episode. Because that hits you right in the feels, and you're like, God damn it. Then again, if anybody knows the uh, story of Hachiko in uh, Shibuya, Tokyo, it's pretty much the same damn story. But he doesn't know the Hachiko story. Basically, think the Fry's dog story. Kind of the same thing. This dog would always, uh, basically, his owner uh, lived close to the train station in Shibuya, and uh, the dog would, the dog was kind of like super trained, so it would just like sit out in the yard without a leash or whatever, and it would always walk down to the train station to meet him after work. Well, apparently, the guy died at work. And the dog went to the train station every day to uh, see when he was coming back, and never did. So now there is a statue of him in uh, Shibuya, and it's a popular meeting place. not deserve dogs. No, not at all. I've had two, and despite the good lives that I think I've given them, it's probably still not enough. Yeah, this one's gonna be a mulligan. Imagine if I had an E-Tank. Just imagine. Be easy. But no, you gotta take him away when I game over. Stupid game. Gentlemen, we got him. <clears throat> now it's just Alien Wowie who we can start at. Hooray! Oh, 
I love how they went from drills in the first one to uh, blood drops in the second one. Or what looks like blood drops anyway. Yeah, he can only be heard by Bubble Lead. Actually, I don't want the, I don't want to be over on the side of the screen, so You know, as a kid, I didn't get that that was dripping blood. So it's just like, why is there just random shit dripping and why does it hurt me? This one might take a while to get used to because I totally forget his patterns. So it's much better to get shot by him than to touch him. The shot only does three damage, he does six. It is hella dumb that you have to go through this every time. No, of course not. You don't get refills until you game over. Thankfully, you can just start here again, so it's not that bad. Also, Bubble Lead doesn't waste as much ammo as Crash Bombs do.
Nope, out of ammo. What I got him. Alright, hurry up and kill me. I got his number though. Turn that shit back. Okay, I did not see an 8675309 reference come through. You know what's great? In my local area code, somebody reserved that number just to play that song. So you call it and there's a machine that picks up and plays a song. Yeah, it does sound like a horn, doesn't it? Imagine that was playing the entire fight. Damn, Zink even did a new walk cycle, too. Like, that's the main reason I'm playing this sprite hack, is it's so goddamn good. And it gets better with each iteration. Instead of the helmet, she drops her buster. That yeah, makes sense. Oh man, feels good. Because the difficulty's all downhill from here. Actually, no, Mega Man 3 is still pretty tough. It's four to six that are easy peasy. And I've never done Buster only on 10, but uh, I don't think it's that hard. We'll see. Yes, yeah, so I, have, I have several uh, bird bop gifts.
<laughs> I have far too many bird gifts. Oh well. Considering my main emotes, pretty much have to have the bird gifts. All right, and that is Mega Man 2 down. And as much as I'd like to attempt Mega Man 3, I don't believe I have enough time, nor can my hand take it. <laughs> <laughs> 